So when you left, Connie was in the shower. Yeah. Yeah, in the shower. And uh, I walked down to the store for olives. No fucking olives. <laughs> for my drink. Is there a reason we're not at a hospital or something? Your wife refused medical attention. And you did kill two people. I think you should walk me through things one more time. Again? Yes, again. We came home from dinner. Matt was drunk. I was irritated. Before, you said he had just a little too much to drink. It's the same thing. Actually, it's not. So then he had a little too much to drink, okay? What are you doing? I'm making dinner. You're gonna get sick if you don't have some food. I'm gonna have an olive. <laughs> Olives are food. Connie, my queen, where are the olives? There are no olives. No fucking olives. Man, you cannot have a martini without an olive. Calls for a mission. He wanted some olives, so he walked to the store. Tell me again why you didn't take them. Because I didn't want to. I was irritated. I thought the walk would do him good. I went downstairs after my shower. I heard movement. I thought it was Matt. I turned the corner, and one of them hit me in the chest. They knocked me down. They put my robe over my head. They taped my head. And, um, I don't know. It happened so fast, uh, they dragged me to the couch. I was bent over the couch. He tried to take my pants off. That's when I knew he was going to rape me. And then I struggled. Are you in your fucking mind? I will not only blow your fucking head off, I will fuck and kill every person who walks through your fucking door tonight. You fucking hear me? You got that? He put a gun to my head and told me he was going to kill me if I didn't cooperate. So I just let him. Sit the fuck still and enjoy the ride. He's gonna loosen you up to take my butt cock. The one was raping me, and the other one asked if it felt good and if he was going to like, you know, fucking me. And he said, it felt really good, and that he was going to like it just fine. <laughs> Bitches puking. That's when I started to throw up. What did they do when you threw up? They laughed. Fucking come here. You gonna come to you? And we're both gonna fucking come. Where you fucking come? You wait for me. Fucking wait. Shut your fucking mouth! You get your fucking turn pretty soon. It's a nice fuck, man. It's a tight ass. What was that call? We're fucking here. You better keep your fucking mouth shut. You hear me? Sit here and you'll keep your head quiet. And then they heard something. The one got off of me. One of them went to check out the noise. Alone at last.
and then there was a clang. And a few seconds later, a big thud. And then it was quiet. Get your fuck up! And then I got away from him. And uh, the other one was screaming. And he left. <laughs> Get the fuck up! We gotta get the fuck out of here! Jesus! That's when I heard the clang again. And I went to the kitchen, and there was Matt, with the skillet, standing over them. And Matt put the gun up off the floor and shot him. me. <laughs> and that's it. And I hope you got it this time because I am not telling this story again. No, I had never seen either of them before. No, I do not know how they got in. And yes, I will be waiting for our attorney. You watch where you're going. I think you owe me an apology. Oh, just because you're blind, you think you can be a dick? Who dressed you anyway? Oh, fuck. You look like shit.